Hello everyone, Deb Floros, guest designer for Art Beads. Do you have a young person on your holiday gift list? How about making a handmade fidget bracelet? Now you can do that by using some 150 seed beads and some matching cube beads. I picked out higher metallic royal purple toe hose. These beads are spectacular. So what you'll do is use some beading wire and string on those 15 O's and you'll want to measure out the first strand for the length of the wrist that you need to make the bracelet for. Then you'll put on a crimp tube and you'll pull on about 13 more seed beads and that will create your loop that you'll attach your lobster to. Then you're going to pull that beading wire through your crimp, pull that down and then you can crimp that section off. And you'll need to be very careful not to crack your seed beads. Then what you're gonna do is string on an equal amount of seed beads, and this becomes your second strand. And you'll wanna measure to make sure you've got the exact amount of seed beads on each one of the strands. So keep putting those seed beads on until you have exactly the same amount, and then what you're gonna do from there is take those cube beads and slide them on to each one of the strands. You can decide how many you'd like and you'll wanna use the same amount on each one of the strands. And those beads slide so nicely on those 15s. Look at that, oh my gosh, they're so beautiful. And that's where the fidget comes in. So what you'll do from there is you'll slide both strands of your beading wire through a crimp tube and crimp. Then you're going to pull on a second crimp tube and you're going to add seed beads to one of those pieces. You can actually cut off the other. Then you're going to add about six seed beads, a lobster, six seed beads, and then you pull your wire through and crimp that second crimp. Then you're going to add a charm over those crimps and look what you've got, a beautiful fidget bracelet. This is such a fun project and great for that young person on your holiday list. You can find everything to make this fun bracelet at artbeads.com. Thanks so much for watching.